<laughs> man, you start the video. No, you start it. We just went through this, man. man you start the video. Start, I always got to do man, the damn video. Care. You start the no, video. No, man. You start uh, uh, it. Nope. They come out here to watch you nope. anyway. Uh, uh, they come to watch you. Nope. All I right. ain't starting it. Welcome to the forearms, y'all. This is Dragon 6 Golf. Terminator 30. And today we got Click Clap. Yep. Top 5 best EDC for self defense. Let's check it out. This music all serious. <laughs> no, right. Numerous <laughs> options exist for everyday carry weapons or EDCs. These are guns that you can carry bring wherever you go without being noticed. With them around, you'll feel a lot safer. Of course, yeah, critics have already thrown down. several baseless you see, claims man? that these Lady, guns didn't this experience dangerous, success you can do in like defending their owners. With a gun. But real gun owners <laughs> would say otherwise. You and I know that these handguns can deliberately draw the line between survival and I like the slow motion danger. stuff. In mm -hmm. short, these carry weapons matter for self-defense. And believe me or not, properly handling Especially these guns make them more effective all. for yeah. self-defense. Now I'm going to give y'all a disclaimer real quick. So, everybody's everyday carry is a personal option, I think. Mm-hmm. And it depends what you're doing at the time. Mm -hmm. So if I'm out in the streets, I'm carrying my little bitty 380, mm -hmm. my little M and P. If I'm out here on the land, I'm carrying a full size because I might run up on a coyote, a pig, or I don't know what. Mm -hmm. So when I say EDC, it means whatever you carry at the time. Mm -hmm. Same for you? Yeah, same for me. When I'm on the land, I'm talking my Taurus G3C. When I'm out in the streets, I might have my Glock 32 or my Draco. Just depends on what I'm at. That, that's the opposite. That's the opposite from what I do. But whatever, man. Whatever it just depends on what we at and what we doing. Perpetuated today. Hello, everyone. This is Bodie from Click Clack. Let me find out people walk around EDC and like EDC that. Self defense for <laughs> 2023. Stick until the end so that you know these awesome handguns that you should. Yeah. Enjoy. Before we start, make sure with the like Remember, I, yeah, I used to it carry it the in the uh, fanny pack, my gun. Video. Yeah. Caltech hey, this is getting back popular, Let's start though. the Caltech P15. Based on how it's currently advertised, the P15 like the draws a perfect balance between firepower, reliability, and concealability. Well, I'm not saying this is a perfect EDC, but it could be for you. This striker-fired pistol features a polymer frame, so expect that it's light. It only weighs about 14 ounces, so carrying it with you on a daily basis isn't a problem. Is Thanks like to a... its double-stack magazine, the gun can hold 16-plus-1 9mm rounds. Yeah, right. So the whole thing is polymer? It flush-fit magazines that can is hold up barrel, to 12 maybe? rounds. It's a good addition for those who want to make the gun as compact as possible. By the way, the unit's already a small weapon. It's just 5 inches tall and roughly 6 inches long. Its barrel length is 4 inches, which ensures that it can deliver straight, accurate shots. That's I can attest good. that this long gun barrel. offers the same reliability as Glock guns provide. It has simple yet efficient assembly that enables it to fire whenever needed. And its parts are made from premium materials, so I highly doubt that it would fail. This gun brings impeccable features as well. Among them is the Tridium Fiber Optic Front Sight and Tridium 2 Dot Rear Sight. Nice. These sights yeah. will ensure that you have a clear target picture after that you using the P322 with the, the Caltech P15 optic sights like that, I like that. Yeah. Pound trigger pull. It is crisp and provides clean breaks. With an MSRP of $450, the Caltech P15 is definitely a good deal. Kinnick TP9SF. It's quite unbelievable mm. that many people don't include the Kinnick tp 9 Man, there's so many pistols I haven't even firearm. touched. For me, it's like hard to find any even. reason to dislike yeah. this weapon. That's a nice one right there. I like the way it looks. I like the rail on the top. How it's like, uh, got the little holes for the air. The they make it real small like this. The or not Kelkin. No. Um, the get-go, this gun is a suitable choice for individuals who are searching for a lot of high quality pistol. Like 18. It comes with alluring features such as its trigger. It also ushers decent reliability, which is a must-have for any EDC weapon. TP speaking of, it said that's the Glock killer, but I doubt it. Arguably, it's Man. one of the best triggers you can find among its contemporaries. In fact, I can say that its triggers are better than the some of the triggers the Glock sales. on Sorry. guns. It's better than the stock triggers used in Glock, CZ, and H and K. Bro, As a polymer striker-fired pistol, you can guarantee that this weapon is actually lightweight. It's I guess I walk around with my pounds. shirt like While that, man. Tucked in. This weapon has a like little tight capacity. shirt where my boobies be showing. <laughs> which is quite plenty for its size. There's a mill standard 1913 Picatinny rail equipped on this gun, so that you can customize it. I, I eventually I want to get a red dot for one of our pistols, mm -hmm. but I think I've been using. The standard sights that guns come with so long, it's going to be an adjustment. Yeah. I think. It might be easier, though. I don't know. I think it'd be easier. I don't know. You know, the older you get, the more stubborn you get. So yeah. I'm going to be like, ah, oh, this is trash. Or, I don't know. We'll have, we'll, we'll have to play with it for a minute before we get it, like, 
dead on the money. Yeah, yeah. And then the bad thing about it, you put on another gun, you had to re align the sight. Mm hmm. With different upgrades and attachments. <laughs> Meanwhile, its war and tactical sights and front dot sight ensure that you will never lose your target. My only gripe with this weapon is that it only has a single grip module and magazine. And when it comes to aesthetics, it isn't the prettiest. Beretta 92X Performance Carry Optic Pistol. Beretta um, also joined the that's what I grew up with in the Army. X Performance the Carry 92 Optic series. Pistol. This is the latest iteration of the highly rated 92X Performance line of pistols. Technically speaking, the 92X Performance was crafted and engineered through the collaboration of the finest competitive shooters in the world today. The guns under this line are factory optimized so that they can perform well, fresh from the box. The Beretta 92X Performance Carry Optic Pistol embodies the same qualities and ergonomics as its predecessors. <coughs> right from the get-go, it is accurate and consistent. While red dots might not be a thing for EDC handguns, this unit is still equipped with a red dot optic ready slide. At the same time, it comes with optic plates and a trigger big for design her. that makes shooting a lot more comfortable. Specifically, the extreme S trigger of this handgun is fully adjustable for brakes, over travels, and takeoffs. Eventually, gotta get this one level too, of adjustability I want enables you to find the guns that had the army, so I need to get me an M4. Accordingly, this that, weapon offers up to 40% of cal reset reduction as compared to the triggers of the 90 series. When it comes to the trigger system, it's mm -hmm. undeniable that the trigger system of the Beretta 92X RP, Performance Carry Optic RPG, Pistol is the RPG, most advanced yeah. that Beretta has ever manufactured. It's also notable that the gun offers a streamlined construction, achieving the ideal weight and balance Juggernaut of an EDC suit, weapon. Everything. It only weighs 47.6 <laughs> ounces. That's Moreover, it has great ergonomics <laughs> as indicated by its recoil management, grip position, I would have never thought of front that Beretta to be These in a will allow EDC, fast target acquisition but that's a smaller one. Mm -hmm. I also like its magazine well since it's flared and contoured. These qualities are essential yeah, for faster and more precise throws. Meanwhile, its magazine no, release is reversible and oversized Cops. to maximize your handling. Walther WMP-22 There's always this 22? idea that bigger guns can defend you better. Well, there's a truth to that notion. Mm -hmm. Walther, being among the prominent Is gun manufacturers, knows about yeah. this thing. In fact, that's the probable reason why it manufactured the Walther WMP-22. This gun represents the idea that reliability, speed, and accuracy are always priorities when really it comes nice. to encounters mm -hmm. and Is combat effectiveness. Yeah. Yeah, this it. firearm will deliver 45 grain, 22 caliber bullets to your targets at a muzzle velocity of 1,000 feet per second. On the surface, that performance isn't mind blowing, but hitting your target multiple times with this weapon will certainly. Solve That's what I'm talking about. I keep telling facing. everybody. You may not consider the Walther WMP-22 as your first choice for an EDC. After all, it's a large unit. Specifically, this unit is 8 inches long, 5.7 inches tall, That's and 1.5 inches wide. Yeah, yeah. Meanwhile, but look, he's carrying it carrying out, out for hunting. I think that counts too. That's an EDC. A well -made crown. But with a proper holster, you should be able to carry this gun with you. Due to its generous length, Walther was able to equip the gun with impeccable metallic sights. Notably, there is a red fiber oh, optic he, he on its front like and rear notch backyard. that comes with <laughs> Yeah, if you enjoy as the our bunnies run, as soon as they see you. Yeah. I like that, it's a nice After all, gun. it showcases mm -hmm. cross-directional texturing together with the iconic palm swells and grip angle of the manufacturer. Its controls are all ambidextrous as well. The slide lock lever on both sides of the yep. gun can be Making accessed dinner. easily. Taurus 605 Defender. The Taurus yeah, 605 revolver. Defender is the I don't know why people dismiss to revolvers too. Man, that's been yeah. Engineered to perform in various defense situations. That. Specifically, it works for both personal and home defense, which is actually a good thing. That's a to nice that, looking the pistol. The Taurus 605 that's Defender sweet. comes with impeccable like features grip. necessary for every defensive gun owner. It features wood grips made from Ultimate, which maximizes your control over the weapon. Moreover, it has night sight so that you can use it in low visibility conditions. I also adore its streamlined frame construction and clean barrel design that ensures simplicity in its operation. Right I can like a judge. Mm -hmm. quite easy to carry. Like it's also tailored for speed draws make, I like uh, regardless of if you're into now. OWB mm -hmm. or IWB. Compared to its predecessor, the Taurus 605 Defender has a slightly longer barrel. Its barrel length is about 3 inches, which enables it to strike a That's good balance between compactness magnum. and sight Taurus radius. Revolver. It is a testament that this gun remains accurate in short to moderate distances. By the way, the yeah. Taurus 605 is chambered in Midnight 357 accuracy. Magnum, but it can mm -hmm. also fire 38 Special and plus P rounds. Hence, it definitely has the firepower that can tackle your problems. If you want to see more informative videos like this, just click the subscribe button and notification bell. Y'all subscribe to this channel. Care, man. And stay safe. Yep. Click that, brought it. Hey, he said it. Which one off that list you like? I know you was gonna say. I know you gonna say the Beretta. But besides the Beretta, I like the revolver. The, revolver? the Taurus revolver for yeah. EDC. 
Or that twenty two. That twenty two, yeah, that twenty two Magnum yeah. handgun. Yeah, yeah. semi automatic. I mean people make fun of the holster I have that that I use when I walk around the land. Yeah. It, people say it's <laughs> like that's patent pistol, but it shoot. It's practical though. Tell me it ain't practical. I, I can carry that in a rifle, no problem. Mm-hmm. Easily, because yep. it has like a little hitch on it where you can hitch your rifle to it too, mm-hmm. like a back scrap. Yep. yep. But what's y'all's everyday carry? What y'all out there carry, man? Y'all let us know. Drop it in the comments. Let us know mm-hmm. what y'all doing. Yep. And catch on to Trey Cash. His uh, vids are... He's about to go viral, y'all. He's about to go viral. <laughs> and I'm going to do the DJ Caleb. <laughs> and we got some future plans on some different type of videos we could bring y'all yeah um some of y'all gonna hate it but some of y'all gonna love it yeah and you know what it's your opinion yeah we're just bringing you know i'll i'll create i'll create a talent to y'all how we think it you know we upgrading so yeah our, our work need to upgrade for y'all and everything so you know how that goes yep y'all just stay tuned and keep watching yep so we're dropping a couple videos this week check it out this is dragon's golf Terminator 30. Peace.